What's up guys, Mason Burchett here from Best Buy Metals. I thought we'd do a cool test today. Um, I've got two different color chips in front of me here. These are both Hawaiian blue. Um, one of these is a standard 30% semi-gloss. This is just the Ceramistar 1050. It's an SMP paint system. Uh, this one over here is our new HD finish and it is a Ceramistar uh, frost technology. Um, also SMP, but it's got the extruded coating so it's textured and is supposed to give some increased scratch resistance and walkability and some other improvements. Um, so what I'm actually going to do is I've got a little piece of, uh, of metal here that I cut off actually of this paint chip right here. And I'm going to just test how scratch resistant each of these are against one another um, by kind of running this uh, little jagged piece across the finish of it. And we're gonna see how they perform. Now, quick note, I actually picked both of these samples up at the same time um, from the shop and threw them in my car with a bunch of other samples. And you can kind of already look just from transport how this one is a little, a little dinged up, um, just from kind of getting thrown around in the car a little bit with some other samples. This one was in the same box with it, and you know you really can't see anything on it at all. That texture coating really hides a lot of it. It's, it's pretty impressive. Um, so let's jump right into it. I actually just want to take the corner of this little. Uh, piece and I'm going to run it on the top right corner of this chip right here and we're just going to kind of see what it does to it. So I'm not going to really dig in. I'm just going to kind of lightly do some scratches here. You can already see that those are pretty visible. Um, marked it up a decent amount so it's, uh, it's a little scratched up. Exposed to, the, exposed to the primer for sure. Didn't really dig into the substrate. I'm gonna try that same amount of pressure over here with this frost chip. Definitely sounds different when you're doing it. Really can't see anything on it at all. Yeah, so I think that the frost definitely did better there. Um, that HD finish is just really impressive. Really held up to that a lot. So now I'm gonna do um, I'm going to do one long stroke down this right side and I'm going to dig in just a little bit more. Okay, yeah, so that one's definitely visible and we are, we are definitely down in the primer on that one. Exposed it pretty good. So that one you can definitely see a little bit of a scratch there, but kind of depends what angle I hold this hold this at if you see it or not. I'm trying to get a good angle. You can kind of see the scratch right there a little bit. Not not much though. Especially if you compare it compare it to that one. Yeah, you can see it a little bit, but it's definitely a lot less noticeable on that HD finish. Alright, one more time. I'm going to, uh, I'm really just going to mark up the whole face of this real quick. Scratch off style. Yeah, so that's pretty scratched up there. You can, you can see it really didn't hold up to that very well at all. Let's do that with the uh, HD finish. Okay, you can see where some of the paint was coming off there. And you can see the scratch. You can see the scratches at that angle pretty good. Depending on how the light bounces off of it though, like right there it's almost invisible. Over here you can see it a little better. But it doesn't really matter where you hold this one, you're gonna be able to see it. So that's pretty cool how this one, the way that uh, the HD finish reflects light at different angles can really hide some of those scratches a lot better than just traditional, uh, you know, 30% semi-gloss can. Uh, let's really dig in here. I just want to see how... Yeah, that one is that's pretty painful. That was like uh, rubbing fingernails on a chalkboard. Do the same here. Okay, yeah, that one, that one you can see. Um, so I think that it's pretty evident that this HD finish is a lot better than uh than this traditional finish is as far as holding up to scratches it's 
pretty impressive stuff, not gonna lie. Um, you can do a whole roof in this system. We stock coil for this here, Best Buy Metals. It's getting really popular. Um, it's obviously a lot more scratch resistant than the traditional finishes. Pretty cool test, guys.